The longer inflation remains well above target, the greater the risk that the public does begin to see higher inflation as the norm. And that has the capacity to really raise the costs of, of getting inflation down. So finally, history cautions strongly against prematurely loosening policy. I can assure you that my colleagues and I are strongly committed to, to this project and, and we will keep at it until the job is done. I can also assure you that we never take into consideration external political uh, uh, considerations. You know, we, we, we are accountable to the public through Congress. Literally, changes in monetary aggregates have, have not had a consistent, reliable relationship. They haven't been a good predictor of the economy or of inflation. Now, of course, the economy is ever changing, and, and that too could change. Uh, you know, to where it is uh, important again. But but for now, and for, for really many years now, monetary aggregates don't play an important role in our formulation of policy. And we don't think they're generally a good way to think about policy or about inflation. It's more about demand and supply and things like that.